And today's sponsor is Mini Sapuru. It is a 15-in-1 triple monitor docking station with 140 watts power adapter. More on that later. Now in CES, Sony showed their brand new card that you can play PS5 inside. In fact, they actually used the PS5 controller to bring out the car to control it and drive it out, which is really cool. Today, we're going to look at the Afila, which is the Sony and Honda collaboration car. Just look at the inside of this car, super slick and simple looking. These are all touchscreen, but you can control it as well with the one knob right in the middle while you are driving. I love technology, how simple it is, but sometimes it's too simple that you run out of ports and you won't be able to connect multiple things on your computer, kind of like the MacBook. The problem with Macs is that we don't have a lot of ports, a Mac book air you only get one or two usb ports with mini sapporo you'll be able to bring that up to 15 all in one docking device with this as well you'll be able to use display link so that you can have multiple displays it supports three screen display output two with display ports and one with hdmi it has three USB-A ports, two of which supports five gigabytes per second data, and one that supports five gigabytes data transmission and charging. It has two USB-C ports that supports 10 gigabytes per second data transmission and high speed charging as well. It also has SD card and micro SD card card slot it has one gigabit network port and 3.5 millimeter headphone jack if you want to get the best quality sound the usb-c host port is used to connect the computer and supports charging up to 85 watts so what are you waiting for if you are looking to bring your mac on the next level with multiple screens this is the way to go grab one today a mini sapporo link down below not to mention that mini sapporo dock is also super simple design i love it kind of like this car now the side mirrors are kind of optional here because it has cameras and it has a screen on two sides of the car as well those two screens you'll be able to see what the side mirror sees it's all touch sensitive as well so you can move around have split screen and watch or navigate at the same time it's super intuitive as well you can download multiple apps so that you can use it later on the top of the car as well has this sunroof and it's pretty much a moonroof where it spans the front up to the back. It also has LEDs all around which is super amazing. Another unique thing that this car has is it has a actual LCD screen on the front. So basically you can customize this to whatever you want from the app. So it'll show how much you've charged or you can put whatever you want. I just love how beautiful the interior is because as you could see here, you can span the whole thing for if you're watching a movie or you can put music on one side, uh, change the themes as well. That will change the color of your car, the interior lighting. So for example, we're using the uh, Spider-Man right now. It'll be purple all the way around here on your side as well, on your speakers and all the interior lighting pretty much. Super awesome. Now, of course, the best thing about this is you can remote play your PS5 from home to this if you're bored and maybe if you're long driving or something like that, the people around you will be able to use that and utilize that even in the back, even on the passenger seats on the back. Now, one thing I didn't get to show is that the wheel and also your seat kind of pulls away so be when you're coming out of the car. So as soon as you open the car, it will actually pull away. And when you're coming in, it, as soon as you close the car, it'll automatically set it to your custom uh, spot where you are when you are driving. If you will need to charge this as well, there's two spots on the two sides on the front side of the car. It also has lighter sensor on the front here. So it'll 
do a 3D mapping while you are driving. As you can see in the back as well, there's two screens so that you can connect it to the PS5 as well or just watch movies when you're long driving. Overall design is pretty cool. Um, let me know what you think about the Afila, Sony and Honda collaboration. This will have uh, autonomous level three, full EV as well. Thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.